Hey guys, welcome to another video. I'm Nikki from Nikki Zimmer, and today is a special video. It's the first episode of the Aldrich family. We're in Hanford on Bagley, and it is um, the year 1920. So we, I'm, I'm so excited to play this series. Um, I have made this forever ago. I will link the video up in the right hand corner if you want to go check out the whole storyline and just everything. But I was waiting on the horse ranch pack to come out so that we could get the mini goat and the mini sheep and a horse, obviously. Um, with the chickens and the, the cow and um, we're going to do a garden, have a little farm. A little bit of backstory is, is it's obviously 1920 and they just moved here from Windenburg. Tom's father passed away and so when he died of a massive stroke he left this entire farm to tom and this is where you know he grew up they're both from hifford on bagley so they decided after eight years to move their family back um and her parents live here and her sister lives here and you will get to meet them and but it was like their first time getting to ever meet their grandkids. And 1920 was like a major year in general. For women especially, it was the first year that women were allowed to vote. So we will be voting as a woman on here very soon. I don't even know if the... It's open to boats. We can try though. We can try. Okay, we can. We can vote on neighborhood action plans. Um, let's see. We want to do green gardening because power conservation. Um, we try to do simple living and off the grid and fun loving community. Let's try to look for another one even. Eco friendly appliances. So it's your first time to vote. Petition water conservation. It's a very big moment. Okay, so next on the agenda um, is obviously to get the animals. We need a horse. So let's get, um, I have to click on anything just to go to filtered items. I don't want to filter to horse ranch. I feel like I might obviously add like a couple of things, but not, I'm not trying to like go crazy because I actually really love how it looks now. I might update the fireplace and maybe add like a rocking chair outside. That would be really nice instead of this table just add a couple of rocking chairs maybe with the pillows I think it's a nice little um something to add I don't know this is really nice See, we have these, like, one chairs in here, but I almost like these better. I feel like they go better um, with the time. 
see, I, I think it it adds a little something, but also like also makes it a little bit more simple. Like I said, I don't want to go too crazy. We're just, you know, we're in the first episode here. And there's a lot, a lot to do just um, as we go on into it. Yeah, we're going to keep those. Um, we need one of these, the horse bed. I anticipated needing so much more space than I actually need for horses. I stretched this out so far thinking I'm not going to have enough room and I have plenty of room so I'm actually going to move this down <clears throat> and do the same over here. Just throw this little trash can over in the corner. I need to lighten it up a little. This I'm keeping. Maybe we'll just even lean it this way. Um, I accidentally like swallowed the hay. Okay. just do this and then this way we can get rid of this and scoop these down by two that'll give us a ton more gardening space like a whole extra like big row and then we'll fix the fence I think I'm going to replace the fence and do these, the light wood. They're just taller and I like the way that they, what, do I want to do these? Or, or do I want to do the other, like these? I feel like I want to do... I haven't tried, um, oops, yeah, no, I want to keep these, for sure, I like that it's taller, um, get rid of this, and we'll add in one of these, see, I'm, I am so excited. Can we scoot it? Yeah, we can scoot it down. We'll just move the flowers over. I knew I was going to have to adjust. Um, the trash can can just come on over, like over here. Um, and I want to build like a little something for the mini sheep and goats. Like, I feel like they're going to be all alone, like, you know, hanging out. Um, should I scoop this back just enough so I can add in, like, the food or the food and water trough? Speaking of food and water trough, oh, this is, that was random. This tub is a way better tub option than what was already here. So we're going to switch those out. See, yeah, I love that. It makes so much more sense. Um, we don't really need a horse ball. But we do kind of need like a horse training spot. We obviously need this. This is a big part of our gameplay. Um, because don't you know, it is the era of prohibition, and we're going to be illegally making nectar. So we're going to have to hide it back here. 
way back in the back where now I can't see what's going on. And I have to scoot in. Okay, we're going to put it like right here. Hidden away. We're kind of really far away from everything anyways, so... I mean, the chances, but... Also, I'm going to add some fray grass around, and I don't think I have already, but we are going to add some to the wild fray grass as well. Put some, like, over here. I'm really excited if you can't tell that at a horse. We're not adopting. This is going to be my first one that I'm actually going to make. Um, and pick out the colors and all that. A salvaged barrel. We can't spend all of our money. I might add this in. Just, it looks cool, you know. Cleaning supply kit. Perfecto. Okay. I know we're going to need like a lot more things. But right now I just want to focus on um, the horse stuff, the food and water. Okay, horse, food, stall, and water trough. Do we even really need, um, I guess we could just add it in. And everything, I might want to add one of these. The Lone Star Lantern, but lift it up on top of the barrel. So we have just like a little light. Outdoors. We need to like run and check on things. Is that like, yeah, that's like too high. I'm going to have to drop it down a little. Perfect. Um, also, I want to replace the radio because the radio is super cute. This one is very realistic also. So why not go with it? Maybe this color. Yeah. I feel like we need a little lighter color. Just... I should have stuck with the, the regular one. Okay. I think we already honestly have most of our stuff. I'm thinking about switching out the fireplaces. It's really not that much of a difference. But... I just feel like I would like it more. Or we could go old style wood burner. Maybe we could do wood burner in the kitchen. And then, like, I know I'm going a little crazy. I realize this. But not like too crazy just a little I want these to be switched okay things are just not there we go I have to put this why is this happening you need to be moved because I want that over there and that up there, okay. 
Like, I just feel like, you know, we need multiple heaters in the house. But that's going to be in the way from the sink. So what if I add, there's no room to add a wood burner. Unless I make the room just a little bigger. I mean, as small as our house is. I, I could just make this a little bigger and then, you know, adding, because honestly, I'll be real, I kind of want to have another baby. So we're going to need the room anyways. And then a wood burner would be a nice extra, you know, fit in the house. To keep everything nice and warm during the winter. And then we'll put this over here. So, no, that's not going to work. <laughs> okay. And we're going to move everything back in a different direction. That was a little strange. It makes sense to go straight outside, though. I would like it to be there, but... I mean, it is in between windows. I could just move the window down. It really bothers me to not have centered windows, by the way. Just FYI. We're going to leave it. I really want to have the wood burner. Um, I think that's it. I think that's all that we need. Why do I keep trying to add stuff? There's no room in this house to add stuff. But, we could replace that cabinet with this. Oh, and it makes more sense even. Like, I, I just have to now. And it's like all cast iron and, you know, it works. Do all the outside windows have shutters? Because I have not gotten to use shutters yet. And I'd really like to use them. Um. Okay, that's is pretty cute. Colors. Probably not going to use shutters. Just because I don't like the clipping on this what particular one. And I honestly don't have the time. Um, that's okay. That is okay. Last look. Do we need anything else? What is this? Galloping Gulch Basket? No thanks. Oh, we need a wine thing. <laughs> Second video, I've called it a wine thing. A wine rack. I know it's here somewhere. It's wine storage is what it is. Nectar. Why did I say wine? It's a nectar. It's a rack. Storage rack. Um, we'll have to hide that. Like, in the bedroom as well. I wish I could go, like, if there was, like, further out. They should have made this property bigger. Um, I would have, like, made it, like, all of this. Because there's so much that can be done up here. But, and I even thought about moving the entire thing to Chestnut Ridge. But I thought, no. I, I've already come this far, like... To move it all now would be insane. Okay. 
We are in this. There's one thing I really did forget to add. And that was a lamp. I want to add a lamp on top of this so that they have a little extra light. Because if you didn't know, they are off grid. So there is a water source right next to them. They collect the water. And it's just a whole thing. They make their food. They have to sell their cows and their chickens. Yes, it is sad. But it is life. I'm sorry I'm taking so long to find this kerosene lamp, oil lamp, whatever kind of lamp it is, it's a lamp. Okay, see what a difference it makes? Now there's two, and they can actually see what's going on. Okay. It's nighttime, so, oh, this is Eloise. I want to reintroduce everyone. So this is Tom, Eloise, Grace, and Baby, wherever he is. Is he in his crib? No. Where is he at? Oh, he's just chilling outside. And baby square. He's very cute. Um, we have bunnies. This one does not have a name, but we do have multiple bunnies. Okay, so here's our little setup. I'm going to go ahead and add some food. Man, call animal exchange. Should we just buy one? Just purchase a horse. I think I like the element of just random out. I haven't done this shit. I've adopted every time. Is did he just Okay, we get to pick it out. Oh my god. Oh, I don't really want a baby because we need tornado. We need a stallion. We don't need a stallion. Okay, go on, Elder. That looks just like Shallow. I can't get Hot Pursuit. Aggressive. How can you be aggressive and mellow at the same time? Friendly, intelligent, and brave. I feel like babe is such a good option. Let's do it. And, and she's so chocolate and cute. Okay, so I modified her and Cass. I would love for you guys all to meet. Licorice. Aldridge. She's so cute, huh? She's got these two little spots on her muzzle that are so cute. I love her. She's so beautiful. She's Like I said, she's the first one that I actually got to um, decorate. So, now that we have her, we've got a cow's. This is my first. The baby is also oh, sleeping. Normal. That's great. This is my first time having it all together. I'm so excited. Um. Now I just want to clean it. Clean Gertrude and feed her. It has been a while since I've played this. I need to move this back a little bit. I just realized. Okay. They're kind of close. Um. 
I'm not managing, but I do want to save this. Okay. I think I'm going to have to angle this in the, in the corner. Like, this is what I was afraid of. Just, like, not having enough room. I think that's fine, actually. I can just sit this stuff, like, over here. I just don't want her to be, like, right next to the horse. Uh, it might clip. It's actually clipping over there, but it will just pretend that it's not clipping. It's it's made that way, you know. Um, maybe I'll fix it the next time. Maybe I should have left it alone. But for right now, I love it. I love how it looks. <laughs> oh, they can enter. Oh. They can interact. Oh, oh, slick him, Ganguya. <laughs> okay, we have to take care of the infant. Okay. Oh, baby. You've been so busy. He even has the horsey. Alright, so we're gonna get Eloise. Everybody's unhappy. We're gonna cheat it all away. Oh, the. Oh, cloth diapers. Replace, even though we're not gonna really do that. This is like getting wild. I'm gonna add this to her inventory. He's not feeling. Wait, can he have any interaction with the horse at all? I'm just so curious. <gasps> Babble at licorice. Smile at licorice. Watch and wave at licorice. Oh, <laughs> that's so cute. Okay. Banjo, banjo, when you out of glappy. The things are just a little wild right at the moment. Oh, she, she just had to go to school like that. What is this attitude? I roll. Um, I'm gonna have to invest in a little, oh, see, poor baby, she just does not have a lot of room to run. Can they leave the proper, I mean, they can leave. I don't know. Alright, let's just go ahead and add in the mini sheep and goats and get a move on here um call animal exchange again i guess buy many sheep and goats what colors do we want i feel like i want a chamois mini goat and then i want a dalmatian mini sheep They're in his inventory now. Oh, they should be. There they are. Place in world. Place in world. You didn't know. Not in your house. Jeez. And I just hit travel. Oh my gosh, okay. 
We're going to rough start. We're going to rough start to the, oh, oh, this video. Okay. Please don't add chamois to the house. Too late. You already did. Can I pick it up? With my arrow. Make no, ahead please, please. and just let them be placed. And then I can move them. God, I can move them. Just like a little item. And we'll place them behind the fence and make them stay there. And because thankfully they have um, a little gate thing. This is um, lock for many sheep and goats. Um, allow access to lock for all many goats and lock for all many sheep. So you guys are in there. How many chickens do we have? We have two hens. We need to buy some chickens. We need a rooster. We'll get two roosters and then the rest hens. And that is all. I want to have full capacity of animals. I'm really excited about this. It's gonna be crazy just to have all of this like to do, but you guys, we have all of it. After all this time of not having, um, you know, cows and goats and sheep and chickens I don't, have we really had goats and sheep i don't remember that but we have had horses with the cows and the chickens and it's been the longest time waiting for this to happen we could have dogs and cats it's it's just awesome i'm so happy so, to a very crazy first episode of the Aldrich family, I'm excited for so many more. I really hope you enjoyed this completely crazy setup episode, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.